There was no quiet on the Western Front. The time is 1916, when a new breed was born, a new kind of hero, the air ace. Here are the heroes, the cowards, the daredevils, blazing across the skies. Grabbing for glory four miles up above the thunder of no man's land. The Blue Max, a film big enough to encompass a world war. Yet intimate enough to share the dreams, emotions, and personal conflicts of men in battle. We've tolerated you here because we've had to. I wonder if you're as good as you think you are. In or out of bed. Starring George Pippard as Lieutenant Bruno Stocker. Brilliant, brutal, ruthless. His great obsession, the Blue Max. An ounce of metal and silver. But for this man, it was proof that he was equal to all men and greater than most. I'll see you never wear that medal. You disobeyed my orders. I'm going to have you court-martialed. James Mason as the general who thought he could use and control him. And Ursula Andress as the general's beautiful wife who decorated the rich tables of the high command. A dangerous woman with a craving for handsome heroes. They're going to disgrace him. An officer with the highest decoration Germany can give. All because of your stupid little anger. Do you understand? This film recreates the time of valor when brave men flew against terrible odds. Each country had its own most coveted award for its hero. For France, it was the Croix de Guerre. For Britain, the Victoria Cross. For America, the Medal of Honor. For Germany, it was the Blue Max. There will be many great war films, but above all, there will be the Blue Max. Blue Max.